big water fight is brewing between the state and the Navajo Nation. Good afternoon. In the middle of a drought here in New Mexico, the Navajo Nation could be getting a lot of water. A group of lawmakers says the deal that made that happen under former Governor Bill Richardson isn't fair or constitutional, and they want something done about it. News 13's Cole Miller is live in the newsplex with the story. Well, Kim, this involves a deal between the Navajo Nation and the state. The Navajo Nation could be getting a lot more water from the San Juan River than Albuquerque, and lawmakers want the Supreme Court to step in. Water has become an extremely big issue in this state of New Mexico. It's an issue that hasn't gone unnoticed by State Rep Carl Trujillo. This drought situation that we're in, we don't know if, what the new norm is. We have to identify what the new norm is. In, in identifying that, we have to make sure that we have water for all. So when former Governor Bill Richardson signed a deal with the Navajo Nation on water rights back in 2010, it raised some eyebrows. Trujillo says the settlement is illegal. It's unconstitutional. It needs to be ratified by the legislature, and that's why we're sitting here today is because of that reason. Trujillo says that deal never went through the legislature, adding any tribal compacts such as water or gambling have to. A lot of this is preserving the right of the legislature. And to preserve that right, Trujillo and a handful of other lawmakers have asked the state's Supreme Court to void the deal and have a new one submitted to the legislature. There's many people in the legislature, representative senators, that have a lot of knowledge on water. They're all representing different people from around the state. The deal in place has been approved by a district court judge in San Juan County and would give the Navajo Nation 600,000 acre feet of water from the San Juan River every year. That's six times the amount Albuquerque gets for a population a third of the size. It's unclear how it's going to affect those commitments on the water in the San Juan Chama diversions. Trujillo says the Navajo are no doubt entitled to a good chunk of water, but the deal needs to run its legal course. Lawmakers say the deal Richardson agreed to would cost the state millions. We reached out to the Navajo Nation but didn't hear back. Now attorneys did tell the Associated Press they hadn't seen this lawsuit but opposed any changes to the settlement. Kim, back to you. Okay, thanks, Cole. Now, lawmakers are also concerned the Navajo Nation could sell off its portion of the water to other cities. An appeal has already been filed in the district court decision.